Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the welterweight bout between Matthew Smelsberger versus Uroz Medic. And how I feel about this one right here is I'm going low confidence um, Uroz Medic to beat Matthew Smelsberger. Um, and why I'm going with um, Smelsberger, not Smelsberger, why I'm going with Medic here is I feel it's not really a clear, great track record behind Smelsberger versus Strikers. And also, it's not really a clear track record, uh, track record of him really mixing it up and um, wrestling opponents and having success in that. Like, you know, I think he might have mixed it in a couple times, but that has never really been the, his path to victory. You know, the Chaos Williams fight, that probably was a fight, you know, he should have used wrestling maybe to edge the fight. But actually, I think Chaos Williams might actually have had more success taking him down in that one. And, um, yeah, it's not, he's not really the greatest offensive wrestler. Or at least he has not proven to be that in his UFC career. You know, he has done a good job to rally and beat some of these guys that, you know, try to wrestle him or even come up short in those cases. But as far as striking, you know, he got struck by Alex Morano, got struck by Chaos Williams. So he hasn't really, you know, as far as a person that's like really a known striker, you could say, oh, Jig Matthews. But Matthews, really for the majority of his career, was not really known to be a striker. He had like one one or two moments, but for the most part, Matthews, Jake Matthews is not really known as a striker. So as far as notable strikers or guys that's consistently known to be strikers or you could kind of put them in the box for a striker. He hasn't had the greatest success against them. And yet it's low confidence for me because Oral Medici is coming up from lightweight to welterweight, so we don't know how he's going to fill out like this weight class or fit into this weight class. But he's already had a long frame, so it's not like he's a shorter, smaller, lightweight. And if he can, like, take some time to put some muscle mass on and goes up to the weight class well, it could be good for me. He'll be faster, he'll be sharper. I don't know how he'll take damage. The Melsberg does have a big power. That's concerning here. But... I think Oros Medici should be the more technical striker. I think the issue is how does he deal with that power. But I guess the good thing he kind of can have in this one is that um, Smellsberger kind of does, you know, headhunt a lot. And that would be easier to suppose the guy that's going to mix it to the body, you know, mix it to the legs more. So I think Oros Medici would be the guy that will mix it more levels. He'll go to the head. He'll go to the body. He'll chew the legs up. I think he'll be the more technical striker. He'll be faster. He'll be sharper. It's just the power that's concerning for me. I'm not too concerned about the wrestling of – Smellsberger is he has not really been able to use it. Maybe he'll see the size advantage that he might or feel he has a size advantage, which he probably should have, and try to use it more. I mean, try to implement wrestling. But again, unless I see a guy that really has implemented that to a great degree or has had much success with that or has been able to use that part of the game to pull off victories, it's hard to kind of, well, it's not hard to lean to them, but it kind of leads me in a place where do I want to factor that or do I don't want to factor that? Like, and, you know, then that could, instead of, like, if it's a case they have actually done it, and like, I got to do that. And in this one, he hasn't shown me that so much. So I don't have to do that. And I feel Medit should be able to address the wrestling to the degree that I feel Samelsberger will be able to output out there. And I didn't feel like he should be able to outstrike Samelsberger. But I think this will be a very close fight. I feel like Samelsberger will try to mix it up. He'll probably Okay, successful. It may be one and a half. Well, I'm not one and a half take. Yeah, I guess I say one and a half take. Probably like a half takedown, not really a full takedown. One takedown and like a, I kind of took you down, but whether I fully got it down and got two, or whether you know it kind of like had you lifted up against cage, but you were able to just escape it narrowly and not give up the point or not give up an actual takedown to it. And I kind of see that as far as Sam Ellsberger's um, takedown rate in this one. Then on the Fiat, I think um, Erlen Medici is going to be the more consistent, more active striker, and again, attacking on more levels more consistently than um, Samelsberger. And I think he beats Samelsberger in a decision victory. Close fight, but I think Erlen Medici pulls off the small upset. So in this one, I have Oros Medici via decision. 